Hey, and welcome to this tutorial. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to harden and soften your edges in Maya. If you would like to follow along, the Maya files are available through the VFX Real membership over on my Gumroad. Joining the membership not only gives you access to some cool perks, but it also helps the channel out too. This tool is changing the vertex normals of your meshes. Harden sets the vertex normal perpendicular to the vertex, giving a hard look to the edge and soften has the normals more spread out evenly across the surface, averaging the normals across a soft edge. In our scene, I have some examples. Let us just focus on the cubes first. The first cube is set to have hard edges and you can see it is displaying correctly as we would want. Compare that to this other cube where we have set the edges to soft. You can see how it's trying to average the normals on the edges and it's given us a weird effect. Soften isn't going to work on sharp angles like we have here, as it works best when there's less of a jump in the angle to kind of average between. To fix this, hold shift and the right mouse button, soften, harden edges, harden, and now we get this nice result. You can see how soften edges is doing a good job averaging out the normals here on this cylinder. But of course, these edges at the top and the bottom are hardened or else we get this weird effect like we have here on this cylinder, where the sides work, but these top and bottom edges don't. To fix this, we can select the edges we want hard, hold shift and the right mouse button, soften, harden edges, harden edges, which makes our cylinder look correct. Another way to get to this tool is by going to mesh display and notice how we actually have harden and soften but we also have a soften slash harden option too, which is actually automatically going to decide which edges to make hard or soft, depending on a smoothing angle we can define. So let's go ahead and choose that tool. Check out the attribute editor. By default, the smooth angle is set to 30. Notice how when we increase the setting, more of the edges become smoothed until it gives us the same effect as applying soften edges to the whole mesh which we don't want. Now, when we go ahead and decrease, we will start to get the result we want. But if we keep decreasing, we will eventually get the same effect as to if we were to apply hardened edges to the entire mesh. I'm just gonna put this back to default as it works great for this example. A good rule to keep is to just think about where a hard edge would be placed naturally and harden those, softening the other edges. A tip is to just kind of apply soften slash harden as a starting point and then just tweak individual edges with the soften or harden tools until you're happy. Again, the Maya files are available through the VFX Fuel membership over on my Gumroad. If you would like to follow along, joining the membership not only gives you access to some cool perks, but it also helps the channel out too. Well, thanks for watching. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you did, hit that like and subscribe buttons, come chat with me on the Discord, and I'll see you in the next video.